1.5, half a degree Celsius, yet it can save us from a huge strife. See, even if it's about shooting an arrow far away, it is not about the work of tomorrow, but today. I say so and I think, hey, we can make a difference, act with a bit of wit and intelligence. What if our children in all innocence turn to us and ask why? Why did you lie and talk about using paper and not plastic? Sustainable development when you were not even able to build a safer environment with your ethics. Did you feel as bad as the fish, the fauna? Did you feel it as they felt it as you turned it all into a sauna? How could you even sleep? Temperature creeps and you still acted like a prima donna. Yes, I know it was hard to collaborate, but don't give me excuses, don't elaborate. You flooded our dictionaries with terms intergenerational, as if we're just germs, CBDR. Yes, responsibility is as different as we are, but it's not just about the poor and the rich. It's also about love, that emotion, magic, and not committing crimes, just like a wise man said many times, justice is what love looks like in public. 1.5, half a degree of warming, that or we might be heading to our own demise. I hear this call and I think when we get asked this because we will, at least we can say we had the political will, but the outcome was otherwise because our models were inaccurate, not precise, the banks got desperate, the finance got jeopardized, at least we could blame it on fate, lack of precision or money, not to say that we should, but not lack of faith, delusion or something funny. 1.5, half a degree that can save you and me, and next generations too, did you realize? We now travel in time and come from the deep sea, because we heard about the IPCC, the United Nations and their triple C's, and we heard you gathered researchers, businesses and people from policy, so please remember, as you consult with each other, that if our genetic intelligence cannot make us love yet those not in existence, then let us not just aim to get a world safe to drive, but also safe to conceive, be human and thrive, so that when one thinks of offspring, one does not think of carbon burdens, but rather songs to sing, family in beautiful gardens. 1.5, a fact that all should learn, the fire of love should not melt the ice, act now and the world won't burn.